Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Jenkins CI on Windows 11 operating system by the simplest way. First of all, just go to the any web browser and here just type Jenkins, okay? And hit enter key on your keyboard. First link is from the Jenkins.io. Open that link. It is an official website of Jenkins. Here is the our Jenkins. Here we find download. Just click on the download. Okay, here we find scroll down here. We find our operating systems. Here is the my operating system window. Just click on the your operating system. We are going to install on Windows. So I just click on the Windows and it is redirect to another page. And here we find our download is started. Our setup file is now downloading. It takes few seconds depending on the your speed of your internet. Okay, now just click on the show in a folder. Okay. Drag this file to desktop. I have already one file. Okay. So here is the our setup file Jenkins. Okay. Just double click on it. Just click on the next. Here is the our default destination folder and don't change it. I don't want to change this. Okay. Just click on the next. Here we find two options: run service as a local system. And second is the run service as a local or domain user. I have no account or password. So I just go to the first option. Okay. And just click on the next. Okay. Here we find port 8080. Just taste the port. Okay. Or it is available. So don't worry about the port and just go to the next. Here we find most IMP part. It is supported only Java 1.8 and Java 11. And I installed Java JDK 1.8 or 80. I installed Java JDK 80 and it is support Java 1.8 or Java 11. Okay. So 110% Jenkins is not work. So I just install it and show the error and I solve this error. Okay. Just click on the next, next and install it. Click on the yes. Now our installation is completed. Now we just go to the our browser once again and just go to the new new tab and type local local host 8080 8080 is our port just type local host dot hit enter okay local host double dot 8080 is not 110 percent working okay so problem is our java jdk okay so first of all we has to uninstall jenkins okay so just go to the start control panel okay now just go to the programs and features programs and features just find jenkins at here select that uninstall it uninstall it okay we are just uninstall our jenkins okay now close it now we are going to install our java jdk okay now just go to the here and just go to the oracle java jdk just type oracle java jdk open the first link it is from the oracle.com i give this link in the youtube description also okay here we find java download here is the our java download and the latest version is 80 previous is the 70 we don't want these two version scroll down scroll down scroll down after this we find java 8 and java 11 i has to install java 11 so i just go to the java 11 okay now here we find windows at here just click on the windows at here and here we find 64 bit installer so i just go with the 64 bit installer okay dot exe file i just click on i receive okay and download java jdk jdk 11 okay now it's asked for a sign in just add your username and password if you have not a username then create an account i just go to the create account and then i sign in just add your username and password and just click on the sign in now it's starting java jdk 11 downloading okay Click on show in a folder, drag this to desktop, close this. Now just double click on it, click on the yes, 
just click on the next next don't change the folder location close this now we are going to set up environment path so just go to the our this pc c drive program files here we find java double click on java here we find two option java jdk jdk 18 and jdk 11 i just go to the jdk 11 here we find pin double click on pin and just copy this folder or path okay just click at here and just copy from the c to bin okay copy it now i just go to the start and just type environment variable edit the system environment variable click at here okay now just go to the environment variables here we find path just click on the path and just go to the edit okay just find the path and just go to the edit here we find c program file java jdk 80 just replace it if you find this then replace it with the edit and just paste the our new path l1 okay now just click at blank space and click on the okay okay now just go to the java home edit now just replace this path with our new path paste our new path and remove pin from here click on the ok now click on the ok now we check our version ok now just go to start and just type cmd ok command prompt and here i just type java jdk java space hyphen version and hit enter but it is showing java version 80 because we not change our in environment just go to the edit the system environment again okay and just go to the environment variables again and just go to the our path once again edit okay now this time you has to delete this c program file common file oracle java java path just select this and just delete it just find this path and just delete it okay now just click on the okay now just click on the okay now just click on the okay now close this now once again just go to the cmd command prompt once again just type java space version hit enter now this time we see our version is java version l1 okay so our version problem is solved okay once again we just go to the our setup file here is the our jenkins double click on it just go to the next don't change the destination folder just go to the next just go to the first option just go to the next test the our port it is okay just go to the next the imp partition is here okay here is the jdk 80 we want to change it to l1 okay so just go to the change and just go to the back here we find jdk l1 okay just select this click on the okay now our java jdk is l1 okay now just go to the next just go to the next and just go to the install now just click on the yes finish it now just go to the anyway browser once again just go to the local host double dot eight zero eight zero hit enter key okay local host eight zero eight zero hit enter now the next step is very simple unlock jenkins okay just go to the this file okay secrets okay and just go to the intel admin password so we just go to the our explorer or just go to the our this pc okay now i just go to this pc okay i just go to the here okay now here is the our c drive okay c okay just go to the program data if you not find program data file then just go to view show and hidden items okay now it is showing us a program 
data just double click on program data here just fine okay jenkins okay here we find jenkins double click on it here we just find dot jenkins double click on dot jenkins here we find secrets here is the secrets and in this secrets we just find intel admin password okay just select this intel admin password right click on it and open with notepad just open with notepad and copy this password this is our password just copy from here to here okay copy it now just go to the here admin password paste that password paste it at here control v or paste it and just click on the continue never now here we find two option install suggested plugin okay select plugins to install i just go to the install suggested plugins now it install all plugins automatically it take few minutes now just add any username any password confirm password your name and email id i just add username as admin my password rewrite that password my full name and email id then just go to the save and continue now i just go with the this url okay don't worry about this i don't want to change it save and finish now, now just click on start using jenkins now here is the our jenkins so i just log out and sign sign in once again so i just add admin it is my username and the my password and just click on the keep me sign in and just sign in so guys this is the simplest way to download and install jenkins on windows 11 operating system by the simplest way so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel thank you guys